Hello guys, welcome to iBlockchain channel. In this video, you will learn how to create a payment platform, a crypto payment platform that accepts payments using your token and another tokens like BNB, USDT, USDC, USDX. Okay, how to create a payment platform that accepts your token. Of course, if, if you can, doing something like that you will add a very big value to your token because it will be a, a, a usable token the users can use your token to to buy some uh, services or some products from your web store okay first go to zerox.factor.com and here from the home page you will find crypto payment and also you can find the same on the free dApps on the main menu here you can download the crypto payment first back again to the home page to able to see the demo here click the live demo to open the demo your payment platform will be like that it will show the product name the product logo a description about your service or your product and the price and the payment options here the payment options will be like that in this sequence the first payment option will be your token and after that BNB, USDT, USDX and USDC the users can pay by any of these payment methods okay let's try buy this product by my token uh, of course this is just a demo token not a real token okay click this button to pay using ZXF, this is my token. Okay, let's connect. Now we are connected. Now I will buy this product by my token. Click again to pay. The MetaMask will ask me to approve this uh, transaction. It will be 20 because my token equal 15 cents and $3 equal 20 of my token ZXF. I will click next after that because I will pay if I click approved I will click approve after that I will wait a few seconds to start the payment of my token 20 uh, DXF token okay and also will be the same like BNB of course BNB doesn't require approval but USDT USDX USDC will require approval first okay so the user can be using any of these tokens great back again to their X factory and start let's start to download the free script actually this is completely free script click start now you will download the crypto-payment.zip file here we will download this file crypto-payment.zip extract this file and open the folder here two files we need to uh, edit the first file is config.json we can open it using any text editor okay let's start edit the configuration file config.json all what you need now to change the default wallet this is the owner wallet the wallet which received the payments remove this wallet and put here your own wallet after that, some information about your token, like token name, type here your token name, token symbol, type here your token symbol, and token contract, this is your token contract, and your token price, as I told you, my token, uh, my demo token uh, price is 15 cents, type here your token price, and token enabled, the default is true, true means the users can buy using your token if you make this false this will disappear this option will disappear and the users can be only using BNB USDT ETC okay so if you want to accept your token leave it true if you want to remove your token because maybe your token not ready now you already not have a token whatever the reason if you want to remove your token from payment methods just make this false okay after that save this file this is the first file the configuration file config.json the next file is the most important file because this file will including your products itself 
the file products.json open it also using any text editor you will find here a demo of three products product demo product one demo product two demo product three of course you can add any number of products you want but you have to add the product details in this format the first thing is id okay make it sequence the first one id is one second one id two third one id three okay the product name after that the product only type here your product you will show in here demo product one okay this uh, item after that the description this is the description type here your product description it will show in here after that the url the url means the uh, url of the uh, uh, the redirect url after the payment completed for example if your product is a digital product like a software or pdf file or anything the user will download type here the download link of your product after the payment completed the system will redirect the user to download this file so that type here the url of the download uh, product or the downloadable product or maybe to a google form or maybe to a thank you page whatever you want this url will redirect immediately after the payment completed after that the price for example this is three means three dollars it will appear here and after that the logo this is the logo of your product of course you can add a different logo for every product like that okay this will be the logo so every product you have or it is better to add a different product a different logo for every product and do the same for every products okay the id the product description url price and logo okay you can add any amount of products you want or services after you finish adding all your products save the file after that what you need now is to upload all this file to the subdomain of course you have to upload these files in subdomains like pay.yourwebsite.com or payment.yourwebsite.com whatever you like but it must be a subdomain upload all this file to the subdomain after that you have to get the link of every product because you will use this link in your main website like now the default link is the product number one only but what if you want to go to product number two it will be like that which mark id equal two and click this is the link of the product number two copy this link and add it to the main website to the relative product and if you want the product number three make it like that id equal three and of course if you have 100 product id equal 100 okay you know now the system you have to bring every link for every product by this way id equal the product id that is all you don't need anything more and of course later if you want to add more products you can open the products.json file and add some another products and upload this file again to your servers thanks for watching and i hope a good luck for all